Hello, my beautiful Aries dragons. Welcome to your full moon reading for October 20th, 2021. I have pulled out some overall energy cards and let's go ahead and get into this. So I, the, the cards that came out are you are good enough and work through your fears. Something is holding you back. Okay. And a lot of times it's the fear of something that needs to change. We need to create some sort of change. Now, Here's the thing about this full moon. It's about rebalancing our relationships and it's your part. So are you maybe giving too much or maybe you're taking too much and it's okay. In relationships, there's going to be times that you give and take differently, right? So it's okay, but it's sort of like reevaluating them and seeing what exactly needs to be done here. Okay. So you are good enough and work through your fears. Yeah. It's hard moving into the unknown. Anybody who says that it's fun or that it's easy. Yeah, your ten of wands is in the reverse. You're going to feel free. I think you have burnt out in the past. Um... Let me get the card that fell. Sorry, guys. Oh. Yeah, your four ones and this in the reverse. I feel like you um, you may have avoided you may have avoided something that you were supposed to do. I think you might have been burned out though. Okay, but. Um, I think you're avoiding a responsibility and it caused the four of wands is in reverse. Um, I think that you, maybe you, instead of dealing what you need to, you sort of ran away from something. Okay. Um, let's get more. Let's clarify. Actually, I'm going to clarify this right off the bat. Ten of wands, please. Because these are heavy cards, right? With the two cards that came out on top, these are heavy cards. We have the Five of Swords in reverse. Yeah. Just a second, I have a card here. Ah, the Ten of, Ten of Pentacles. You need to change your idea about what stability is. And I, I think that you're trying to run away from it a little bit. The Four of Cups is in reverse. You're very unhappy, obviously. You're very unhappy with it. I don't know if this is even making sense, guys. But you're, you have your Four of Wands and your Four of Cups. Okay, but you also have two tens. So tens are about closure. Okay, it's about moving on. It's about being at the end of the cycle. But you have your two fours in reverse. And fours are about sort of like risk stability and order. So you've been unstable and unorganized and you're not doing what you need to do. Um, I think fear is keeping you held back, but you're avoiding it. You're avoiding it. More cards, please. Let's keep going. <laughs> You're feeling hopeless. Um, you didn't take care of something. Yeah, look. You, you didn't take care of something, and so you've sort of given away your power, and things aren't happening as fast as you wanted them to. Okay, things aren't happening the way that you want them to, and you've, 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 lost your opportunity to do it. You didn't take care of it. You guys, you have so many cards here that are that you didn't take care of something. And it's because you're afraid. Okay? You need to take care of it. And I feel like it hits you hard because you have you are good enough. So you need to really go and get your self-confidence up. 
as you go through this, okay? Yeah, look, your Eight of Cups is in the reverse, right? You're running away without facing your problem. And you have another four, Four of Swords. So it's... I feel like you are trying to recover and that's why you're running away is because it affected you so deeply. You just, it's like, I can't deal with this now, but I think right now, okay, that's fine that you did that in the past. Now you need to, you need to work through your fears. You've taken the time that you needed to heal. And now to continue to heal, you need to keep moving ahead with this, right? Yeah. Look, the Empress, it's time to start new beginnings with courage and strength and look, King of Wands. That's you, okay? That's a master of the fire sign, right? The priest, look at this, okay, guys. You need to go and dive deeper. This is all at the top of the deck, okay? The empress, strength, the king of wands, and the high priest, okay? The hierophant. So you need to go and take care of this and find your power, find your strength, and create these new beginnings, create your abundance. You need to move into this energy, Okay, you need to go and find the people and get learn the spiritual lessons that you have had. Aries, this is a very encouraging reading, but you need to work through your fears. Okay, you have to do it for you because you're good enough. You can't do it for anybody else. You have to do it for you. Okay. <sighs> yeah, justice. Okay. Justice is at the bottom of the deck. It will work out in your favor, but you do need to work through your fears, whatever this is. Okay, Aries? I, I Should I try and get more cards? Are you going to give me more cards? Okay. Yeah. Your Ace of Cups is in reverse. Yeah. So you're, you're, I think that you're trying to move ahead into different areas. And yeah, love didn't. Love didn't develop the way that you had hoped it would, and so you are having to walk away. But the Five of Cups, it shows that it's almost like you can't. Um, you do need to let go of this. You need to release the past. Okay, You need to let it go because it didn't come into fruition. So maybe you were trying to hang on and make something work that didn't. And this is sort of like... I just, I just heard it, something in my mind, and I don't use this word. I implore you to please move on, right? It's almost like it's like, no, listen, you need to pull yourself out of this, Aries, okay? You need to go and become that king of fire that you are, okay, guys? So um, it's a beautiful reading, but guys, you, you have to... You have to work on you, but you also have to work into moving past these fears, okay? You're being called. You're being called to move on and to let go, okay? Please like and subscribe, and I will see you for your next reading. Thank you, guys.